Let friends in your social network know what you are reading about former President Barack Obama offered some of his most pointed criticism yet of President Trump during remarks at the Democratic National Convention. A link has been sent to your friend's email address. A link has been posted to your Facebook feed. President Obama calls out President Trump for his lack of leadership and called on Americans to vote in his DNC remarks. USA Today former President Barack Obama offered some of his most pointed criticism yet of President Donald Trump during remarks at the Democratic National Convention on Wednesday, arguing that his successor has turned the presidency into one more reality show that he can use to get the attention he craves. What we do these next 76 days will echo through generations to come, Obama said in one of the most closely watched addresses in the convention's third night. I never expected that my successor would embrace my vision or continue my policies, Obama said. I did hope, for the sake of our country, that Donald Trump might show some interest in taking the job seriously, that he might come to feel the weight of the office and discover some reverence for the democracy that had been placed in his care. But he never did, he said. Read USA Today's live coverage. Barack Obama, Hillary Clinton and Kamala Harris speak on the third night of the DNC Though Obama has criticized Trump's policies before, his remarks Wednesday were far more pointed, and personal, than he's been in the past. Obama rarely mentions the current president by name, even as Trump has slammed his administration on a near-daily basis, but did so twice Wednesday night in his 19-minute speech. He has shown no interest in putting in the work, no interest in finding common ground, no interest in using the awesome power of his office to help anyone but himself and his friends, Obama asserted in a live address delivered from Philadelphia. Donald Trump hasn't grown into the job because he can't, Obama said. And the consequences of that failure are severe. Trump wasted no time firing back. Responding to excerpts of Obama's remarks earlier in the day, Trump described Obama as, so ineffective, so terrible, as he offered an extended criticism of the Iran nuclear agreement intended to slow Tehran's path to a nuclear weapons program. The reason I'm here is because of President Obama and Joe Biden, he said. Obama accused Trump of using the military as a political prop, a reference to the president's photo op during Black Lives Matter's protests in Washington. They understand that in this democracy, the commander-in-chief doesn't use the men and women of our military, who are willing to risk everything to protect our nation, as political props to deploy against peaceful protesters on our own soil, Obama said of Biden and his running mate, Senator Kamala Harris.